What's up guys? Um, just going to make a quick little video today. As you can see, I have custom themes on this PSP. And it is on 660ME version 1.3. Now this will work for 660 Pro, 660ME, and 660LME light CFW. So uh, I'm going to show you how to put CXMB on your PSP, how to enable it, and where to put the themes because everybody keeps sending me messages and I'm sick of answering so many goddamn messages so here's the video alright so first and foremost download the file that you got in the description and once you do that connect your PSP to your computer alright now over here on the computer, you will see cxmb660.zip. Go ahead and open that up. Now inside that, you're just going to see this. A CXMB folder, alright? Now, this is my memory stick. So I'm going to open up the folders. And you see all these pretty folders on my memory stick already, right? All we want to do is take this CXMB folder that you downloaded drag it uh, drag it drop it on your PSP so that you see the CXMB folder with all the other folders on the root of your memory stick now you can open that folder up and you'll see this conf.txt cxmb.prx now the only other thing you have to do to get CXMB to work is go into your SE plugins folder. If you don't have an SE plugins folder, create one now. Make a new folder, call it SE plugins. Open that up. You see, I got all this wonderful stuff inside SE plugins. We're only concerned with this one itty bitty little guy down here vsh.txt. Open up vsh.txt. If you don't have a vsh.txt, create one now. All right. So, what we're going to do on a new line all by itself type ms0 colon slash cxmb slash cxmb dot prx space one now the one tells your PSP that the PRX is enabled and once you add that line cxmb will be turned on alright so you can close this make sure you save it so now you save vsh.txt and you're all set now CXMB is on enabled. So now you probably wonder, well, what do I do with the themes? How am I going to get the themes on there if, uh, if I want themes? So open up PSP. You'll see this folder down the bottom called theme. I'll open it up to show you. There's all my CTF themes are inside the theme folder. Now I'm going to include every single theme. I have 48 themes on this PSP right now. I will zip up all 48 themes and I'll throw them in the description. You can download every single theme that I have, place them in the theme folder, PSP slash theme, and you'll have all the themes. Now I'll show you just real quick. I'll exit USB mode. And if you go over here to theme settings, and then go to the first one, custom theme. You'll see all these icons. There's an icon for each individual theme. So you just uh, locate the theme that you want to use at that particular time. I just put uh, the Peace Walker theme on here, so I'm gonna install that one because I love it and it's badass. It's right there. You press X, press X, say yes to overwrite the current theme and then it will import the theme off the memory stick and it will reboot your PSP and you will have a custom CXMB CTF theme on your PSP this is my probably one of my all-time favorite PSP themes right here I love this theme let me see if I can focus this goddamn camera there we go it's pretty focused I love this theme it's fantastic Fantastic theme. So there you have it. 6.60 CXMB 
So please stop sending me messages, please. I probably get like four messages a day asking about CXMB. Yes, it works for 660. No, I have not made a video. Yes, I just did. All right, guys. So there you go. That's installing CXMB, installing a theme. So yeah, make sure you subscribe, like, comment, leave me some reactions. I love getting those reactions. I got 17 on another video. I heart reactions. So leave a reaction. And uh, check out sneakycodes.tk and sneaky-media.com for all your ISOs, PSP movies, PSP friendly downloads. The whole site is PSP friendly. You can check that shit out right from your PSP. Your parents won't even know that you're downloading movies. So yeah, check that shit out today. We need, uh, we need some more loyal members. So sneaky-media.com. Help keep it active, guys. All right, Sworn Leader signing out.